Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking to you about how you can win a few more games in Foot Champions and kind of improve your ranks, get a few more ranks up. And I'm saying most of the average people should be aiming for around Gold 3 or Gold 2. And there's lots of people playing the Weekend League right now. Of course, it is the first one. But there has been kind of extra week, like a, I think it's a week and a half or something like that. I know some people had Xbox, EA Access, other things like that. So they were actually on it longer. Longer, but there should be quite a lot of people that are not that good playing weekend league right now But the first real tip is going to be definitely make sure that you have fitness on your cards This is very important in my opinion You should do it every after two games So apply squad fitness after every two games or if you're going like pro you really want to get possibly 30 out of 30 Or even 25 wins something like elite 3 or elite 2 Definitely go for bronze squad fitnesses and use those every single game so after every single game just use those and the second tip is going to be definitely have a good subs as you can see here This is my current sub bench. I have Hummels. I have Taliska. I have Lozano, Depay I do have Sommer as well in goal, Kimmich as well But these are just backups if anything happens for the defenders and I would actually recommend the defenders Some of them are actually quite overlooked people don't usually put defenders on the bench But if you do want to kind of hold off a game want to put a five in the back it can actually be very useful I have put on Hummels I think in a few games I've only played I think four or five games and it's been going pretty well also I would definitely recommend you to use game plan so when you go onto ultra defensive you can change it to go onto five at the back and that is very helpful of course you still go need to go and manually do the subs and other things like that if you want to change if you want to bring on a defender but it is very easy to do that and you can also set up all of the cat custom tactics and everything like that and another thing that is definitely very useful is going to be the kits so as we know there has been a new kind of feature in for champions uh, from FIFA 18 that it's your kits so you can pick whichever one kit you want to see and then the other the other player as well has his own choice but you can actually get an advantage on this if you actually choose like contrasting kits for example black and yellow red and blue this will actually be helpful for you because the other person might not have it he might have extra stuff on the kit but I'm actually currently going to use the ones to watch kit which is just basically blue and then I've also found a red kit on the transfer market just plain it is best when there's no advertisements you just want to focus on the game as least distracting as you can if you could just have a plain white and plain black kit that would be very nice but for all I know right now that is not currently available and another thing that I'm sure quite a lot of you are already going to know is take gaps in between your games this is very important and very overlooked in my opinion I am most likely going to be playing maybe two or three games I know some of you don't really have the time to take breaks for example if you can only play on the weekend you just want to quickly play games and you don't really want to or if you can only play on a Saturday you just want to play all of your games in one go but still you can still take a break just go and check Twitter watch a YouTube video take a break for around 10 minutes or something in between each game and it will be very useful and if you are quite angry or raging a bit definitely take a big break one two hour break get your mind off FIFA and when you come back definitely Definitely do a warm-up game that is very important as well even when you just enter foot champs definitely do a warm-up game before thank you guys for watching this video I hope you found it helpful and do not expect for you to suddenly be a really good foot champions player it does take practice but if you follow these tips it will definitely help you out thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time